series. This is the lecture series on practical image processing using OpenCV 510. And we have already gone through several lectures. Myself, Dr. Dibos Dibora, I hope you all know that. So today's topic is how to adjust contrast of an image. And what is contrast and what is the mathematical background about it? We have already gone through it. So please refer my theory classes on image processing if you have any doubt on that. In this lecture, our objective will be to practically go through the contrast adjustment of an image. Okay, so as we are talking about OpenCV, in case of OpenCV, we don't have any particular function to adjust image contrast, but its official documentation suggests an equation that can perform image brightness and image contrast both at the same time. So you have to focus on this equation. This new image is equal to A cross original image plus B. Do remember this equation and you can take a screenshot of this. So now let's discuss the equation in de details. So here A and B seems to be unknown to us. So let us discuss about them. A is alpha, which defines contrast of the image. And there are three conditions with respect to the value of A. If A is greater than 1, there will be higher contrast. Do note it. Okay, if A is greater than 1, there will be higher contrast. If the value of A is between 0 and 1, smaller than 1 but greater than 0, there would be lower contrast. And third condition says that if A is 1, there will be no contrast effect on the image. So we have seen there are three conditions with respect to A value. Okay. So B stands for beta and its value vary from minus 127 to plus 127. Now, to implement this equation in Python OpenCV, we can use add weighted method. And we are going to use this method because it generates the output in the range of 0 and 255 for a 24-bit color. Okay. So don't mind. So what is actually add weighted method? We, need, we have to know about the syntax of this method, isn't it? So the syntax of add weighted method is as follows cv2 dot add weighted and you all know what is cv2 we have had an instance of our open cv in cv2 so this is the dot operator i can say that the membership operator then add weighted then you have seen these are the parameters as our as source image one comma alpha one comma source image 2 comma alpha 2 comma beta all these are parameters and you see that we have already described what are they now this syntax will blend two images do note it will blend two images the first is the source image with a weight of alpha 1 and the second source image that is the source image 2 these two images will be blended if you only want to apply contrast in one image, then you can add a second image source as zeros using numpy. You already know in one of my lectures, I told you that how to create a matrix using zeros with the help of numpy. And in, our, in this case also, we don't have other images. So the np.zeros will be used to create an array of the same shape and data type as the original image, but the array will be filled only with what? Zeros. So these two images then will be blended with this add weighted function. So I hope this theory portion is clear. Now the code for implementing this is this one. Okay. Have you seen this? So take a snapshot, the screenshot of this. So import CV2, 
you know that import numpsnp as we are going to deal with array manipulation so i am importing numpy's instance np image this is the source image give your path where you are storing the image and in this experiment i am using the popular one that is lina image and in my data set i have one special data set image data set that i have gathered to perform this different type of experiments in image processing so this is stored in image data set of Kaziranga University of under C drive. Then contrast image, I have given the variable's name as contrast image is equal to cv2 dot add weighted. Then this is the original image that is image 2.5 alpha value. Then np zeros, you know that the second image is filled with, means we have created an array to fill with zeros. So the shape, size, dimension are taken from this image, that is image dot shape. We have discussed this shape function in the last, last class. Then image dot d type, comma zero, comma zero. Okay, you can go through the syntax. Okay, and the match with the values alpha two and beta two. You will get the values. Then cv two image so original image, original image will be shown. Then cv two image contrast image contrast image. So contrast improve image will be shown. Cv two dot weight is zero. Okay. With that, we'll perform this experiment. So let's open the spider, okay, then perform the experiment. So this is your spider. spider. So one by one, you just type the uh, commands. I am executing one by one, then import CV2, execute it, you will see in the console part. Then next statement, import numpy, numpy imported, then original image, taken and saved in image, then contrast image. This is the very equation we are talking about. Let's execute this equation. It's executed successfully without any error. So let's display our output. Ready? So let's display them. See, this is the original image and this is the contrast and hence image clear so we have seen that contrast is improved as well as the brightness also but brightness in the case of brightness what are the values we are putting so go through the equation but you will definitely see the contrast is manipulated in the output image so clear so guys i hope this lecture you find useful for performing the contrast adjustment so go through it, implement this, and don't skip this experiment because practical sessions is meant for you. So you have to practice well and you have to learn well. We'll meet in the next lecture. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.